going on guys? My name is Eric Janikin. If you guys don't already know, I am an online fitness entrepreneur. I built a seven figure online fitness coaching business, Faction Training, over my right shoulder and Global CEO is my consultancy business where I help coaches build their online businesses. So if you guys are not subscribed to this channel, I'm gonna be giving a ton of free value. So go ahead and click that subscribe button. It means the world to me. It's free to you. Um, hopefully it will help you build your business. But in this video, what we're gonna be going over is how to get your first 4K client. So the reason I say 4K is kind of, that's just a general rule of thumb of high ticket programming. So we teach high ticket because of the fact that you don't have to sell volume. Where people get in the rat race is trying to go online and selling $50 programs, $20 apps. With high ticket, what you're doing is trying to sell to a niche market that can afford your services and actually understand the value of the coaching, the accountability, the tutelage, the guidance, and the sustainability that you are going to provide to them. So the reason I say 4K, that's kind of just a general rule, is 1,000 per month uh, for, let's say a four month program comes out to 4K. So just plus or minus about 1,000 a month is what's considered high ticket. Anytime you go down to like 200, $150 a month, that's like mid ticket, low ticket. So what we're trying to do is stay in high ticket. So the big question I get is how do you, Eric, how in the world do you get people to pay you three, $4,000 for a program that's strictly online with no in-person contact? And when it comes down to, if you guys have not watched my last video, uh, four actionable steps you can take to build an online high ticket business, please go check out this video because this one's gonna be focusing, focusing more on how to actually get that first client. So if you guys don't, haven't watched that one yet, it goes over offer creation, uh, which is extremely important, uh, creating your roadmap for client success to get consistent results for your clients, so on and so forth. So go watch that video first. But without further ado, let's hop into how to get your first client for 4K. So to start is picking your lowest hanging fruit. I think this is something that people shy away from uh, just because it's sexier to like think about paid ads and organic marketing and getting new leads in your pipeline, which is important, you'll get to that. But to get capital in your business and to get people that already trust you, pick your lowest hanging fruit first. So the first modality you can do is upselling your current in-person clients. So basically the way to do this is when somebody's coming up to the end of their package, let them know you have an exciting new offer that you're developing. Um, just basically let them know like, hey, I'm moving in a new direction with my business. It's actually gonna provide a much higher quality of service to my clients. Um, next, before you meet with them, do the math on how much they currently spend with you per month. Let's say they spend 12 sessions at $95 a session. That's about roughly $1,140 per month, right? So now you know what they're already currently paying you. So just set up a time after your session, just make sure you don't, you have like 30 minutes to speak with them. Um, and basically let them know that you're moving your business into an exciting new direction and offering a greater quality of service. As it stands, you're only focusing on their workouts. In your new model, you'll be focusing on a specific pathway to get the fast results predicated on nutrition, training, lifestyle, stress management, education, and sustainability. So. The way you want to move the conversation is not, hey, I'm kicking you to the curb. It's more of, hey, I am moving my business in this new direction. I want you to be a part of that. Um, from there, they're probably gonna be like, okay, like, how does this work? So basically, you're you tell them that your new offer, you program every single workout of their week, you focus on their nutrition, basically all of the principles that we went over in the last video of creating your unique roadmap. Um, so say you'll basically charge them $1,000 per month and still offer an in-person session every two weeks. So the benefit to you is, so let's say they were coming in for 12 sessions a month, that's 12 hours. If you then say, hey, I'm gonna still see you once every two weeks to keep pushing you, you know, obviously keep that rapport um, so you don't feel like I'm like just kicking you to the curb kind of thing. Um, and now you're saving money, right? Because they were paying, if you go up a little bit, $1,140, they're saving $140 by doing this new package. They're getting more value, they're getting nutrition, 24 hour access to you, lifestyle changes, and basically the things that move the needle and still getting that in-person contact. So instead for you, instead of spending 12 hours per month with them in person, now you're only spending two. So it's basically a win-win for everybody. So basically if they push back 
Focus on the results versus the medium delivery. And this is what I always tell people. When people say like, oh, well, I mean, like, I feel like I'm not gonna see results if I'm not seeing you in person. You can push back and say, okay, like, are you worried about the results or the medium of delivery? And what I mean by that is, while you might not be seeing me quite as much, we're gonna be focusing on much more of the picture. When you're coming to me for in-person workouts, we're literally only working on 10% of the equation, which is your workout, right? The other 90%, which is your nutrition, your recovery, your stress levels, your hormones, everything else that actually makes moves the needle for you, we're really not focusing on these one hour sessions. So what we're gonna do is, is basically shift and focus on a results driven pathway opposed to just focusing on your workouts. Um, not everybody's gonna do it guys, but if you get even, you know, two of five or one of five to do this, it's a huge win for you. You get to save 10 hours per month that you can then put towards building your online business, which is obviously the goal if you're watching this video. So that is the first way. The second way is reaching out to old clients. So obviously um, they're no longer training with you in person, so it's a little bit of an easier transition uh, to push them towards this new model. So I want you to reach out to every old client you've ever trained. The way to do this, I like to do it, uh, number one is Google Calendar. So you can basically go back and search through your Google Calendar. I know I put all my sessions in there and looked back through like, when I started my business, I went back to like 2018, 2017, 2016, literally message every single person like, hey, how's it going? How's everything with you? And, be, and not saying like, hey, I've got this new offer, but just asking them how everything's been going. Uh, the second one is searching consultation and messages and emails. That's a really good one because if you have had a consultation with them, obviously you've sent the keyword consultation, uh, in your email or text and you'll be able to find people like that based on their first session. Uh, searching for your gym address. Obviously, if you're having somebody come in for an in-person session, you're gonna send them the gym address, so obviously that's gonna show up in your message history. Uh, and then looking through your Yelp leads, if you use Yelp, I know I do, so I went back and looked through all of my old Yelp messages and reached out to people that maybe signed on or didn't sign on. Um, and honestly, guys, I probably got seven to 10 high ticket clients at 4K, at, well, I was charging 4,800, just using this. So do not sleep on this, guys. I know it seems menial and it's not as exciting as like, oh, I'm gonna go out and run some YouTube ads, but I mean, are you guys worried about having it be super exciting or making money? Because I think you guys are more worried about making money or else you should be, or else we have to have another conversation, but this is where to start. All right, let's go down. So don't reach out with the offer, I didn't mention that. Just that you wanna see how they're doing uh, and where they're at. Because if you text them to like, people that you haven't talked to in four years, you're like, oh, I've got this exciting new program, they're just gonna like, not respond. But if you're like, hey, I know it's been a few years, but I just wanna check in and see how everything's been going, and then you can basically just move the conversation and say, hey, like, it'd be great to catch up, would you be open to like, grabbing coffee or hopping on a call? That way it's super organic, they don't feel like you're, they're getting pitched, um, and obviously you're going to have that conversation with them, but it's a lot, easier if you don't if they don't feel like you're reaching them out to them for something after not talking to them for years. Okay, number two is friends and family. So what I put here is a trust gap. So the, what, I, what I tell people is there's an inherent gap between when somebody hears about you for the first time and when they're actually willing to pay for four, three, four K for an online coaching program. And that gap, gap is inherently smaller with friends and family because Let's say, for example, I've run hundreds of thousands of ads, dollars in ads, um, and what I've realized is that nurture sequence and sometimes that buying cycle for people who are hearing about you for the first time in an ad when they actually buy a program for you can be two, three, four, six months of seeing your content, getting in front of you, and actually trusting you. So that's a long time, right? So if you can have somebody that's like literally trusts you with their life almost, friends, family, people you're close with, it's, it's a very, very small gap to bridge and get them to sign on for your program. So I know it's not the most comfortable conversation to try to pitch to friends and family, but a lot of times what you have to think about is reshift your mindset and stop thinking about it like you're asking for something for them. Think about it that you're giving them value. You are giving them lifestyle changes. You are giving them health. You are giving them weight loss. You are giving them longevity. And if you can reframe your thinking of, oh, you're not asking them for a favor, but you're giving them a very valuable service, that will definitely change the way you think about it. 
All right, number two is the five guys, five gals pose. This is something we teach. It's extremely easy to get leads in the door like this. So basically what it is, is on Instagram and Facebook, you're gonna post the following. Um, basically, I'm looking for five niche clients based on your niche uh, who are looking to goals of your niche without hardships. So I'm gonna give you guys some examples because it's kind of hard using that template. So I'm looking for five dads who want to build muscle, reignite their inner athlete, and to look better than guys half their age without cutting calories, doing hours of cardio, or restricting foods. You see how this is a very powerful message? So you're trying, you're basically saying, I'm looking specifically for five people in this niche that are looking for these goals without doing these hardships, right? And that's a very powerful thing to remove a negative or three negatives in this case, because people don't like cutting calories, right? People don't like doing hours of cardio. If you do, hats off to you. Um, or restricting foods. So that's the big thing is you're removing these negatives, you're removing these hurdles. So right when they see that message, you're like, wow, that sounds great. And if they're a dad, they know it's specifically for them and they're willing to pay more money because of that specificity. Uh, and that's something I talked about in the last video if you want to go check that out. Um, so number two, I'm looking for five working women who want to lose belly fat, feel empowered, and take control of their schedule without cutting carbs or doing boot camp classes. Same thing, guys. You're looking for five specific niche working women who want to lose belly fat, feel empowered, and take control of their schedule without cutting carbs or doing boot camp classes. You're basically selling the dream result and removing any negative obstacles. So. The, this is a very simple way, and below you can kind of see how to do this on Facebook. So you can see the photo here. You usually want to use a text box. If you're doing it on Instagram, obviously, um, you can just do this. You can basically screenshot this and repost it to Instagram. But the way you do this on Facebook, you go and uh, open a post, use the color box, so it's a lot more eye-catching. And then basically what you can do is tell people, uh, tell people the comment I'm in or me in the comment section below. Uh, DM each of these people and get them on calls. So this is a very simple way to get people in your niche interested in what you're doing. Um, and it's very surprising how well this works. Uh, number three is referral outreach. This is a very powerful one. I use this myself. So tell all of your in-person clients, you'll give them one free session for them to post on their social media about your new program. So the ones that basically would said, no, I don't want to do the online at all. I want to stick on training with you say, okay, I totally understand that, but can you do me a favor? I'm going to give you one free session. If you can just post about my new program on social media, sometimes you don't even have to do that, but this is just a good way to like create that rapport and just be like, Hey, I know you're doing me a favor. I'll give you a free session in return. So basically have them take a selfie or a mirror shot with you at the gym. Just if you're at the gym, shoot a quick mirror shot with them. Um, and then you can give them, the following script that they can customize. So let's just read it out. I want to give a huge thank you to my amazing trainer and coach, your name, who has helped me achieve said results. They have an amazing new program where they can coach you from where coach you wherever you are in the country. If you're looking to change your life, reach out to me and I'll connect to you. So this is a very good way. I had about I think six or seven clients do this for me, and I got probably 15, 20 leads from it. Uh, which I closed probably five to six because see that gap is so small because they see their friend talking about it and they're, they're much more likely to trust you and buy your program. So definitely use this tool. Um, basically have them post up that caption with a photo on Instagram and Facebook uh, and then give them a hundred dollars referral credit for anyone who signs on. So not only do they get one free session, but give them a hundred bucks towards either towards their next package or just in cash for everybody that actually signs on. And the reason you want to do that is because let's say somebody messages them, you want them incentivized to obviously follow that conversation up, make sure that they're actually getting on the phone with you, make sure they're actually going through with it. Uh, because if you give them that little extra incentive, they'll be much more obviously incentivized <laughs> to help you. Um, so yes, that is the end of this presentation, guys. So obviously, if you guys don't have your offer figured out, if you don't have your niche figured out, that's okay. Go watch that last video. But I hope this was really helpful for you. Go out, try to hit that five guys, five big gals post. Talk to your current clients, try to cross sell them. Uh, talk to your current clients and get them to post on their social media. I guarantee you it will get a ton of leads in your door. I'm gonna do a video on messenger script and on sales script. So I'm gonna be posting those in the next week or so. So subscribe to the channel so you don't miss that bookmark it. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying the content. I will see you guys on the next one.